This article describes the phonology of the Somali language. Topic: <laughs> Consonants. Common Somali has 23 consonant phonemes. Its consonants cover every place of articulation on the IPA chart, though not all of these distinctions are phonemic. The voiced affricate, d, is missing in many northern and eastern dialects, with the voiceless affricate, t, taking its place. Is a voiced retroflex stop. Some phoneticians say that it has an implosive quality for some speakers. It is sometimes realized as a flap, between vowels. The voiceless stops, t, and, k, are always aspirated. The voiced pharyngeal fricative, may have creaky voice. R, is often pronounced with breathy voice and may be partially devoiced. Between vowels it may be a single tap. Q, can, in some dialects, be pronounced as a, x. <laughs> vowels Somali has five vowel articulations that all contrast murmured and harsh voice as well as vowel length. There is little change in vowel quality when the vowel is lengthened. Each vowel has a harmonic counterpart, and every vowel within a harmonic group which notably can be larger than a word in Somali must harmonize with the other vowels. The Somali orthography, however, does not distinguish between the two harmonic variants of each vowel. There are five diphthongs that also occur in front and back, long and short versions, except for i, which does not appear to occur in the back series. Tone Lexical prominence in Somali can be classified under a pitch accent system, in which there is one high tone mora per word. The tone system distinguishes both grammatical and lexical differences. Differences include numbers singular and plural a grammatical distinction, and masculine and feminine genders a grammatical and sometimes also lexical distinction. One example is inan girl versus inan boy. This reflects a tonal pattern that codes grammatical gender, such as damer female donkey versus damayar male donkey. The question of the tone system in Somali has been debated for decades. The modern consensus is as follows. In Somali, the tone-bearing unit is the mora rather than the vowel of the syllable. A long vowel or a diphthong consists of two more and can bear two tones. Each mora is defined as being of high or low tone. Only one high tone occurs per word and this must be on the final or penultimate mora. Particles do not have a high tone, these include prepositions, clitic pronouns for subject and object, impersonal subject pronouns and focus markers, there are therefore three possible accentual patterns in word roots. Phonetically there are three tones on long vowels, high, low and falling. On a long vowel or diphthong, a sequence of high-low is realized as a falling tone. On a long vowel or diphthong, a sequence of low high is realized as high high. Occasionally, it is a rising tone. This use of tone may be characterized as pitch accent. It is similar to that in Oromo. Stress is connected with tone. The high tone has strong stress, the falling tone has less stress, and the low tone has no stress. When needed, the conventions for marking tone on written Somali are as follows Acute accent, high tone, Grave accent, low tone. Circumflex, falling tone tones on long vowels are marked on the first vowel symbol. Topic: <laughs> Phonotactics. The syllable structure of Somali is c v c. Root morphemes usually have a mono or d-syllabic structure. Clusters of two consonants do not occur word initially or word finally, i.e., they only occur at syllable boundaries. The following consonants can be geminate, b, d, per meter, n, r, and, l. The following cannot be geminate, t, k, and the fricatives. Two vowels cannot occur together at syllable boundaries. Epenthetic consonants, e.g., j, and, are therefore inserted. d does not occur syllable final in native Somali words but it does in Arabic loans. Phonological processes <laughs> 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 
Allophones The voiced stops, b, d, and are devoiced in word initial and word final position. Between two vowels they become fricatives. The voiceless stops, t, and k, are realized as d, and in syllable final position. Per meter, is realized as n, in syllable final position. Between vowels, h, is usually voiced to all vowels are nasalized before or after a nasal consonant. Topic: <inaudible> Appenthesis. <inaudible> when a vowel occurs in word initial position, a glottal stop is inserted before it. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Elision. Trisyllabic roots with the form c v c v c v and a short second vowel allied this vowel to become c v c c v except if it would result in t or k occurring at the end of a syllable or being geminate. Topic <laughs> sandy. Phonological changes occur at morpheme boundaries sandy for specific grammatical morphemes. There may be assimilation or elision. One unusual change which can occur is lt to coalescence also occurs. This is a kind of external sandy in which words join, undergoing phonological processes such as elision. In Somali, it is sometimes obligatory and sometimes it is dependent on the speech style. Topic: <laughs> Vowel harmony. Roots have front-back vowel harmony. There is also a process of vowel harmony in strings longer than a word, known as harmonic groups. Topic: <laughs> Prosody. Intonation, as opposed to tone, see above, does not carry grammatical information, although it may convey the speaker's attitude or emotion. <laughs> 